Okay, let's go. Nuevo video del canal de Tony Palacios, el Nicoyas. ¿Qué tal amigos? ¿Cómo están? Bienvenidos a un nuevo video del canal del Nicoya Salcero. En esta ocasión nos encontramos en Santa Ana, en el occidente de El Salvador. ¡Vaya! desde este punto llegar hacia la catedral y eso se va donde, hacia donde nos dirigimos en este momento vamos en la, en la ruta 4 el pasaje cuesta 25 centavos queremos llegar al centro de, de, San, de Santa Ana específicamente lo que es la catedral porque de ahí no hemos hecho tomas en el dron hoy salimos con el propósito de tratar de ver si hacemos la ruta de la flor de alguna manera así que de aquí de Santa Ana hacemos, vamos a hacer unas tomas con el dron que espero que, que esta vez funcione y luego de, de aquí Santa Ana queremos ir a Sonsonate para ir subiendo el zorro de pasamos por los naranjos si no me equivoco y de ahí dependiendo del tiempo queremos ir hacia Aguachapán y de Aguachapán regresar a, aquí a Santa Ana y Santa Ana regresar a San Salvador va a ser un día bastante largo pero ustedes saben que el de Salcedo es así es de pate perro y sin rumbo muchas veces así que acompáñenme en esta aventura Ok muchachos, vamos, estamos aquí en el autobús y me encontré a una joven de Holanda quien está visitando El Salvador Platicamos un poquito fuera de cámara pero quiero compartirles con ustedes un poco Así que a partir de este momento vamos a hablar inglés Así que pongan los subtítulos para que ustedes por lo menos entiendan un poquito qué es lo que estoy conversando con la amiga eh, So, uh, can I get your name? Yes, I'm Rosa Rosa, Rosa. you have a Spanish name I know, that's, I do That's interesting, so you coming from where? Um, well, I am from the Netherlands, so okay. Holanda. Um, I've been traveling now for almost eight months. Wow! Yeah. Eight months. What, 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 what was your, what brought you to take a trip for for the last eight months? Oh, yeah. I really, really want to see the continent. Uh huh. So. <laughs> South America. I really wanted to see that. Okay. So I started there. I started in Bolivia and then uh, I went to Brazil and Argentina and Chile. Okay. Really, really beautiful. Wow. Really beautiful. And then I went to, I flew to Guatemala because I really wanted to feel the culture and see everything oh, okay. that is here as well. Okay. Uh, so yeah. So I'm you went to Guatemala and you also mentioned that you went to Honduras as well, right? Yeah, I went to Honduras. What part yeah. of Honduras do you visit? Um, I went from the north of Guatemala to uh, San Pedro Sula. San Pedro Sula. Okay. And then I went to Copan. Oh, okay. Yeah, I went down. Awesome. And then you, how long you been here in El Salvador? Um, for I think now one and a half week. A week and a half. Yeah. And yeah. do you plan to go somewhere else after you come after after El Salvador? Um, yes, after El Salvador, I'm going to uh, Nicaragua. 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 That's where I'm from. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And Good. then. Um, Costa Rica? Well, it's too expensive. Yeah, yeah, it's it is. It's too expensive. But it's beautiful as yeah, well. Yeah, it's beautiful. It's worth it, but it, yeah, it's pricey. Yeah, it's really expensive. How about Panama? Maybe. Maybe, Maybe I'm going to go to Panama. Okay. But I'm, 
I'm not sure as well, to be honest, okay. because it's really expensive. I see. So uh, you flew from South America all the way to Guatemala. Now you're doing Central America. Uh, after that, do you have any plans to go maybe to the US or Canada or? or I'm what? going to Colombia. Oh, okay. <laughs> so oh, I'm going right. back down to South America. Oh, Colombia. <laughs> yeah, I've heard it's amazing. It there. is. Yeah. It, well, in Colombia you have Cartagena, which is on the on the coast. Yeah. You also have Medellin, which yeah. is very famous. Beautiful weather. Yeah. Awesome weather. Yeah. Bogota is a capital city. And it's kind of cold. And obviously, my favorite city, if you want to know it, it's Cali because I yeah. love salsa. Oh, nice. So, uh, it's something. How do you manage about the language when you're traveling over this part of the um, world? Well, I know my way kind of in, really? in Spanish. Not really well. <laughs> but, you, but I'm trying. And I feel like everyone is really understandable. When I, nice. when I talk in Spanish, when I try to talk in Spanish. That's nice. So they're trying, or well, they are really talking really uh, slow. That's good, that's good. So that helps me. And then I can understand them and then I talk in like <laughs> rubbish. Nice. Spanish, I talk back, yeah. Now, be before you came to El Salvador, let's talk yeah. about El Salvador because this is a country that had a, um, a, a bad reputation in the past. What, what, were, what were your thoughts? before you come into El Salvador and once you came into the country what what what, what went through your mind as, as far as seeing what the how the country was? Uh -huh. Well I first went to Santa Ana mm -hmm. and I did a walking tour there mm -hmm. because I wanted to know a little bit of the history and I've heard everything out of a local's mouth so that was really I think that was really beautiful. Um, but I feel like everyone is so, so polite, so kind, and everyone is really, really happy that tourists are here. Right. So a lot of people have come up to me and, and asked me where I'm from, and that they are really, really happy that I'm here. So I, I, I actually feel really welcome. Awesome. I think it's one of the countries that that made me feel that way. Like how about safety? Trip. How do you how do you feel about the safety I in that country? I feel really safe. Really That's safe. Nice. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah, really safe. Everywhere, everyone helps, and yeah, I have never Beautiful. felt unsafe. And how about the world famous pupusas? How do you, oh, how do you, what do you think I about it? I did a it? cooking lesson. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> I really, really love them. Uh, what, yeah. what, what was your impression the first time you tasted the pupusas? Um, uh, I like the rice uh -huh. better. Okay. Than, the, than the corn, the corn? yeah right. yeah and do you have it with cheese or revueltas cheese, or cheese, cheese a lot of cheese a lot of cheese, lot oh, of cheese. yeah it was <laughs> i love it i love it uh, i'm going to be make them back home as well uh, yeah. Sure. Yeah. you know a lot of people what they do is and i did myself yeah last time i went to nicaragua i bought some pupusas and i took it to my mother she loved oh, them nice. she loved them nice. she loved them. so pupusas is you know a, a very traditional dish from El Salvador yeah. although you can you can also get them in Guatemala yeah. uh, Honduras and Nicaragua as well yeah. but w they are from here yeah. from El Salvador so th these are the original ones nice. okay well I want to thank you for taking the time to talk to us you know yeah, it, it's sure. nice to know that people like yourself are coming to this country and not only discovering how El Salvador is but you also get to see the culture in also in Guatemala Honduras yeah. And since you're heading down to Nicaragua, as I mentioned, uh, make sure that you visit uh, Las Peñitas, yeah. which is good for surf. You can also visit Cerro Nero, which is a volcano where you can uh, oh, do a, a slide. Volcano boarding. Yes, yeah. volcano oh, nice. boarding. There you go. Uh, obviously, you can go to Ometepe. Yeah. And something that you don't want to miss is, obviously, if you can make it to Granada, it'll be nice because yeah. it's a very uh, how do you say this colonial okay, yeah. uh, a city. And last but not least, San Juan del Sur. Yeah. It's a party town. Nice. Party town that I know you're gonna like. It. So. Sounds amazing. Do, uh, do you want anything you wanna say to the people that will be watching this video? <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank you for watching. Subscribe and like. Oh wow. <laughs> All right. <laughs> thank well, you. Well, thank watching. you so much. Bueno, muchachos, así se dan cuenta, así es como hacemos los videos aquí en el canal de Unicaramos en El Salvador. Rose, una joven holandesa que está viajando por este continente, está descubriendo El Salvador y así son las cosas. Inesperadamente, aquí ya tenemos un video de contenido. Ya saben lo que tienen que hacer, como dijo Rose, tienen que darle like. And subscribe. Se le dan like y se suscriben y activen la campanita de notificaciones 
para que cuando tengamos este y otros videos en este recorrido ustedes sean los primeros para ser notificados y ser parte de la comunidad del Nicoya Salcero mi nombre es Tony Palacios del canal Un Nicaragüense en El Salvador y se trae hasta la próxima ¡Vaya! ¡Say vaya! ¡Chao! ¡Vaya! <risa> 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 <risa>